When I was a kid, I delivered newspapers in my community every day. One Saturday afternoon, my friend and I were bored. As a result, we randomly picked an elderly lady's house to be part of our game of throwing stones. To us, the stones turned into missiles as they rolled to the roof's edge and shot out into the yard. They also looked like comets that fell from the sky. I found a stone and sent it for a ride to the lady's roof. However, the stone was too smooth for me to grasp firmly, so it slipped out of my hand when I threw it. To my shock, it hit a small window in the lady's house. On hearing the crash, we decided to escape immediately. For the next few days, I felt so worried about getting caught that I was afraid to think of the elderly lady or her broken window at all. Several days later, when I was sure that I wasn't in any trouble, I started to feel guilty. Every day, the lady greeted me with a smile when I handed her the paper, but I no longer felt comfortable in front of her. Finally, I made up my mind to save the money that I made from delivering newspapers. I calculated that seven dollars would cover the cost of repairing her window, and in three weeks, I had the money ready. I wrote a note that said, "I am sorry for breaking your window. I hope that the money will cover the cost of repairing it." Then I put the money and the note into an envelope. When it was dark, I crept quietly to the elderly lady's house and put the envelope under her door. After I did so, I felt relieved and couldn't wait to be able to look her straight in the eye again. The next day, I handed the elderly lady her paper, and happily returned the warm smile that I received from her. She thanked me for the paper and gave me a bag of cookies. I thanked her and then continued my route.
When I was enjoying the cookies, I discovered an envelope inside the bag. I opened it up and felt very surprised. In the envelope, I found seven dollars and a short note that said, "I'm proud of you."